All right, guys, so I am editing this video right now, and I realized yet again I dropped the ball. So um, I have video four. This is video four um, that I recorded a bunch of stuff, and I've been working on the bike over a couple-week period, and I just didn't get as much footage as I thought, and I've been working, and so I've been trying to get it done after work, and the lighting was bad, so I did a bunch of stuff, and I just didn't get footage of a bunch of stuff too. So I'm going to cut into what I did, which was... I cut the frame tails off the bike and I got some footage of mounting the seat and I didn't get really any footage of making the shock delete struts, but I'm just gonna cut to that real quick, show you guys the stuff that we got done. And then I'm gonna cut to uh, a couple little clips I took of the bike idling after I uh, got it all kind of put back together with the new seat on there, which I didn't get any footage of that either. And uh, I ended up, just kind of buttoning the bike up and it's gonna be a really short video i just kind of wanted to give you guys some closure i guess and show you what i've done on the bike because i just didn't film it all like i thought i did so my apologies i dropped the ball again um i skipped a bunch on the build because it's been so stressful and i've been rushing and trying to get a little done here and there but i promise you guys i know i've been promising for a long time but i promise you guys that our quality of video and everything is going to be getting so much better shortly and you'll see why. So we got the crest wrenches all welded up, got the bushings welded in there, everything is solid and the bike is sitting on its new uh, suspension delete. So I didn't record any of that because I've been working on the bike after work at night and it's dark outside. Um, I'm going to do some more with it though. We got the seat mostly mounted up. I need to mount the uh, CDI boxes. So the IC igniter ignition boxes under here and I think I'm just going to more or less mount them like that and just tuck everything under the seat, wrap this so that it doesn't get damaged and just keep all that hidden under the seat for now. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I know it was a short one, I know it was a jumpy one. Um, I know I missed a lot, but there you have it. Um, I got the bobber seat on the bike. I got the frame tails cut off, uh, got some stuff painted, got my fuel pump put on and just kind of have the bike to where it's rideable and I've ridden it to work a couple of times and very uncomfortable, but very fun. So thank you guys so much for watching today's video. We'll uh, see you in the next one. Stay hungry, stay humble, stay motivated. Bye.